Hey guys, I have another haul for you, and today's haul is from the Victoria's Secret semi-annual sale. Now, I went three days ago, and I found out that that day was the first day after the sale had ended, so the sale is officially over, and everything was 75% off. So, like I've said before, with Bath & Body Works and Victoria's Secret, when there's nothing really specific that I want, I tend to wait until the very end just so I can try to get the best deal. So that's what I did. And I'm really happy with everything I purchased. Not everything though is for me. I do like to buy some birthday presents, you know, during the sales just because you're getting a really awesome deal. And I already have some people in mind on who I'm going to be giving some of these items to. So it all works out really well. So let me just go ahead and show you guys everything I got and I will make sure to tell you how much everything was as well. The first thing I ended up getting was this compact mirror and I've been wanting one of these for a while just to take on my vacations. So you know I have a little mirror available. This retails for $10 and I ended up getting this for $2.50. So I thought it was a pretty good deal. I might as well just get one. The next two items I got were these roller balls right here in the scent, very sexy. And I also got these to take with me when I go out of town just because, you know, if you go on an airplane, they have really strict rules on liquids. And if I don't go on an airplane, I don't like bringing big bottles of perfume with me. So these are really convenient. They are 0.25 ounces each, and they retail for $15. I ended up getting this for $3.75 each. So those are the roller balls I got. The next thing I ended up getting was this perfume, and it is in Sexy Little Things. And the front is really cool, how it changes pictures. This is 3.4 fluid ounces, and it retails for... $49 and I ended up getting this for $12.25 so that is a pretty awesome deal for an actual perfume. The next thing I got was this body mist and this is in Incredibly Daring. It's 8.4 ounces and it retails for $25 but I only paid $6.25 for this. I like this scent, but it is a little sweet, so I figured I would get the body mist for myself so it wasn't as strong. So I got this one for myself. The next thing I got was a gift, and this is the Incredibly Daring Body Lotion. This is 6.7 fluid ounces, and it retails for $20, so I only paid $5 for this one. Then I got the matching perfume. This perfume that I'm showing you now and that body lotion I'm giving as a birthday present coming up soon to a, a family member of mine. This is 1.7 fluid ounces. It retails for $49. So I ended up getting this for $12.25. So this right here, this perfume and the matching body lotion that is an under $20 gift, which is amazing, and it smells so nice. I've said before, I don't really use that much body lotion, and if I do, it's just very, you know, basic, generic kind because my skin is really sensitive. So I didn't buy one for myself, but those two items as a gift are going to be really nice. And then this perfume I ended up getting was the Bombshell in Love, and this is a 1.7 fluid ounce perfume. It retails for $49, but I only paid $12.25. So that is pretty awesome. All of these items I think I got for an amazing deal. And on top of the deals that I already got, I had a survey coupon which gave me $10 off. So I only ended up paying $50.88 for all of these items, which is awesome, awesome, because I got three perfumes a body lotion, a body mist, two roller balls, and a compact mirror. Just one of these perfumes retails for $49. So that is absolutely crazy. But yeah, so that's everything I got. If you have any comments or questions, go ahead and leave them down below, and I will be happy to answer them for you guys. Thanks so much for watching.
Bye.